It's so good, guys. It's so freaking good. It's 3 o'clock. We have a nurse at 6.30 this morning. I know I look crazy. I know. I always come out here looking crazy. Always. Always. Um. So this morning I worked out. You saw you saw me do a little bit of that. I put a little snippet up for y'all that I'm still on my 75 soft challenge. Okay. I was bad yesterday. I did not work out, but I still ate my food. I still fasted. I still drank my gallon of water. I did good even though I didn't work out. It was just a rough day at home with the baby. We are not nursing today. Today's the, yesterday was the last day. I'm kind of emotional, but I've been trying to distract him all day. He's standing right next to me. Y'all know what I'm talking about. We're trying to wean. My boobs are covered. I have on a sports bra, so we can't get to it. He's been in, in, what, what? All day, all day, all day. It's only, it's only 11 o'clock. <laughs> anyway, I'm opening some packages. I worked out. My one son is at his grandma's, so we got one off. We got one off. We still got this little one, but it's perfect because now I could just focus on ridding him cold turkey of the bazam. We should give it a name. So, cause he might hear it and be like, mm, yeah, we gonna say, he don't know bosom, so I'll just say bosom. Anyway, the brastola is what my mom says, is what my mom calls it. Excuse my background. I mean, it's just, Michael. anyway. I'm open packages. Um, I never finished open packages the other day. That vacuum is so nice. I need to charge it though, because I wanna go and run the vacuum upstairs in my bedroom. I think that I'm gonna leave that one upstairs. Um, and then when I get my Dyson, I'll just replace my shark. The shark works good. It's just not as powerful. And I think it's just old. I mean, we've had it for three. That's too heavy, bud. He's playing with the, he loves playing with anything he can push around. So he has the Swiffer out. He has the vacuum out. Anyway, so I got a new TV for my gym room. I love the Amazon Fire TVs. So I bought one of those. I also got, um... A whiteboard which I'm gonna use for multiple things um, a dry erase board I got it for I, want, I was I think I'm gonna buy a small one for my office probably not I don't like them but I got it for the gym but I also got it to um, you know play with the kids and do some do some math addition and subtraction stuff like that um, if you guys saw my other videos I've been like really trying to get Easton ready for 
kindergarten i want him to i have a challenge for myself and him that he's going to read by the end of summer so before he goes to kindergarten i want him to already know how to read and we're getting there i mean it's he's we can talk about that another day but you know he's been in speech therapy um we're trying to like work on phonetics of like letters and sounds but he also has a strong um interest in numbers so i want to start introducing some um algebra to him as well so that's why i got that whiteboard i'll be trying to do the most but my children are the most important thing so the energy has to be given to them um so lately he's been doing like his words we started doing time and money and he's doing really good um he does really good when i have like the little blocks and i take two away and he figures things out that way so i want to keep at it and this summer since he's going to be home we're going to have camp and stuff i'll probably put him in camp and stuff but a majority of time he will be home um so my grandmas do a really the grandmas do a really good job of like incorporating whatever i ask them to do for them so it should be fun this summer we're going to do that um i have a strong passion to be like a homeschooler one day but not anytime soon but what I do with Miles is basically I just talk to him. We haven't really done anything besides like maybe some flashcards here and there. Um, I focus with Miles just like gross motor hands stuff like um, opening things or sticking like different blocks and sizes, stuff like that. He's only one. So, and I just use words, a lot of wording and sign language. But anyway, that's a lot. I did my workout. I'm fasting, so I didn't eat anything. I just had black coffee. Um, yeah, so I don't know what we're gonna do today. Um, since I only have one child, I'm thinking about going to Home Goods. Um, because I've been wanting to go to Home Goods for a long time. I showed y'all what I did last night with the um with the uh the table. I kind of want like some artwork. I've been looking online. I, I know I brought up the artwork I was going to purchase for my bedroom. It's not working out. Um, I ordered the canvas and I don't think I ordered it correctly because <laughs> they sent me an email about something about the quality of the image and I was just like, forget it the shipping was $95 in itself and I was like just forget it so I'm thinking of either doing a print and getting it framed at Michael's I was gonna print it on canvas but now I'm thinking maybe I'll just get a print and like get it framed at like Michael's or buying something to put there at the store but I want something very unique very different very like oh you can't have this I actually sourced this from the internet and printed it and it just I just love that so I'm still thinking of using that photo which I still haven't showed you guys um, I'll show you right now as soon as I find my phone I'll show you in a bit but I do want to get something like aesthetic for our sitting area because I do film sometimes when I do my sit downs I want like I want to create like this aesthetic area so i think i'm gonna go to home goods today i need to shoot like two or three outfits for my shop my closet video because i've been slacking um i just missed two days basically um i didn't upload yesterday and i think the day two days before that i didn't um do anything so i need to do that so i'm gonna do like three or four outfits it's like a gloomy rainy day and I was cleaning up my closet and I found some Burberry rain boots and I want to wear them, but it's not raining. It's just gloomy. And I'm like, is being, is wearing the Burberry rain boots like pretentious or should I wear them? Because it's raining. It'll make a good video, styling video, but I was going to wear them with a trench coat. So yeah, I'll probably check back in in a bit. I'm still trying to upload this vlog. Yeah, buddy. It's the, the my vlog, the solo date vlog, which I'll pop up right here. And I was trying to upload it in 4K. That was my first time. That's my first time ever uploading anything in 4K, and I'll never do it again. That video has been uploading for two days now. Two full days, 48 hours. And it finally said that the upload was complete, but it wasn't. I still have four hours left for it to go to 4K. 
Yep, yep, so it still hasn't posted yet. It'll be up at some point today. So yeah, there's that. All right, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go do some things and I'll come back. This has been uploading for literally two days and I still, it won't post until it hits the SD, right? And I'm trying to do 4K. Usually I do SD, HD. I'm trying to do 4K. This footage better be absolutely, absolutely amazing. I'm gonna watch it on my TV and just to check to even, to even make, to even uh, confirm that the 4K is worth having. I can't even speak. So we're about to, I think I'm gonna go upstairs and like clean out my closet a little bit. Um, I wanna do a little bit of shopping, like real life shopping in my closet um, so I can get dressed. I'm gonna take some vitamins first. Um, looking for my fat burner. I'm trying to incorporate my fat burner. I need that lactation support, that's for sure. I wanna keep Miles busy and away from me as much as possible. <laughs> so going to the store and going to the store and getting them like, how many of these are I not supposed to take? Two capsules. Before a meal, so I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait to take that. I wanted to take this fat burner that I got from, these are from Amazon. I took these before. I mean, that, it's supposed to help you like burn more fat. Um, it makes you sweat a lot <laughs> during your workouts. But I wanna start taking these. So I'm gonna wait until I break my fast to take that. I've also taken this um, bur bur Berberine. I used to take this before and it's supposed to really help with like slimming your gut, like cleaning your gut and it makes you, it curbs your appetite a little bit. Um, I need to do more research, but I don't remember all the things, but it's not expired, but I started taking this. Yeah, it's not expired, so I'm gonna also incorporate this. It doesn't expire until the end of this year, so I'm gonna also take this as my daily supplement um, and my vitamin D, which I always take haven't taken it lately um so i'm gonna take that the burner i'm just gonna wait Ooh. these are these are good too these are probiotics i know everyone drinks prebiotic prebiotic soda poppies and olipops but you need a probiotic in addition to the prebiotic just to let y'all know so i'm gonna take one of those I got one left, I need to order more, I have two left. And I just take one of these a day, but let me tell you, this thing right here, not only are probiotics good for your gut, they're good for your vagina, okay? Um, if you're having issues with bacteria or smell or anything like that, y'all need to take probiotics. So, I'm gonna grab, I haven't filled up my water bottle. Oh my God. Mm, I've been drinking water out of a cup instead of filling up my water bottle. It's 11 o'clock. So I'm gonna take one of these berberines. I don't remember it having any weird side effects or anything. You're only supposed to take one capsule a day, but it's supposed to curb your appetite. And that's what I'm trying to do. Yesterday, I was so hungry. Yesterday, I ate everything I was supposed to. I did fast. I did all the things. But... I um I was hungry so I ended up eating hmm I ended up eating like a bowl of cereal because I was so hungry and it was it was raisin bran crunch which isn't horrible but it isn't that good for you and I ended up eating that Okay, you're not doing anything you aren't supposed to. And it wasn't bad. I mean it wasn't bad, so, but other than that, I still ate my meal plan. I still fasted from two to eight. I just didn't work out that day, so I was on my feet. 
walking around, doing things around the house though. You know, I was hanging out with Miles, playing with Miles. So I burned some calories, but I didn't meet my goal for the day. So I didn't close my rings. Mm. So look up red nails. <laughs> mm, how cute. Whew. All right, so you guys can come up with me upstairs and hang out in my closet. I'm just gonna like hang up some clothes. Um, I wanna leave by one o'clock, so it's already noon. I want this video to post so I can just feel like I'm not monitoring it every 10 minutes. But I wanna go to Home Goods. Um, but I wanna clean up my upstairs space first so that but I want to be out before nap time for him. So, let's go upstairs. Let me turn the light on. Hey guys. You've missed absolutely nothing because I haven't done anything. I look crazy. I don't know how I look, but we made it through nap time. I haven't even showered and I worked out this morning. Judge somebody else. I just can't get to it because of this one. He won't sleep. He hasn't taken a nap yet. It's three o'clock at this point and I'm making my first meal of the day. So I got him some lunch. Now I'm about to make me some lunch because I am starving. Okay, I'm still hungry. I actually ate one of his chicken nuggets. I'm that hungry and I don't even like chicken like a child. So, let's see. I'm assembling my little salad that I told you guys about. Um, I never made the dressing <laughs> with the avocado, but I'm going to add avocado today. I've been making my own little dressing with Greek yogurt and balsamic vinaigrette, the skinny girl one. So, I'm gonna assemble my salad. Decide if I wanna add avocado or not. Let me bring y'all closer to me so I can see y'all. Okay guys, so I'm assembling my little salad. Don't mind these oranges, those are miles. Um, so it's the Panera. I did a play on the Panera Green Goddess, Goddess Salad. Um, I X the dressing. I'll try to make a dressing another time, but I think I'm gonna add avocado today just because I want to, but I've been tearing this salad up. I eat it every day. So I got a pretty little bowl for y'all today. So I do about three cups of my favorite greens. I'm doing the power greens, which are um, organic baby chard, baby kale, and baby spinach. So good. For my protein, I'm gonna do chicken. I'm gonna just slide it right in there. That is three ounces of chicken. That might be two and a half. That was my last piece of chicken. Um, and then my egg, which let me put my chickpeas first. I like to do my chickpeas first, which is another form of protein. I'm gonna do about one third cup. I do one third cup of, where's my spoon? So, just tearing that food up. So this is actually a half a cup. <laughs> but what's the point of savoring? No, nope, you know what, no, nope. follow your, look at me. I'm talking, I'm talking y'all down, but tomorrow I'll open another can and I'll reuse that, so. So I just take, what is beeping? It's really bothering me. One third cup of chickpeas. Then I just do about seven tomatoes. Five, six, seven. That's how much I've been adding because it already is in my Lose It app and I'm not changing. Um, I get my egg and I just slice it up. My little slicer. Ooh. Child, playing the violin or we slicing onions? I mean, eggs. 
Just real pretty. Yeah. Ooh, y'all see that? Let me move, move y'all. Pretty already. All right, and then I get my pickled onions, which I don't think I showed you guys. They look so good and they taste amazing. I go kind of heavy with the pickled onions because I love it. It's like, it's a little sweet, sugary, like extraness, and it helps with the dressing. They just look so good. Go ahead and pop those right there. And, mm. Mm -mm -mm. let me eat one. Mm. I love pickled red onions. Oh my God, so good. All right, so I got my tomatoes. Got my, I'm debating whether or not, whether or not I want to add my avocado or not. I don't know. I don't need it. Oops. I'm supposed to use a tablespoon. I'm doing a tablespoon of bacon bits. Um, I was gonna make my own bacon, but mmm, mmm, give me all the nitrates. <laughs> I just don't feel like it, y'all. So I do like a tablespoon and a half of bacon bits, and then I make my little dressing. Which can y'all see that? Is it looking good or what? Yeah. It looks pretty. Okay, then I just take my um, Greek yogurt and I'm just using the Skinny Girl Balsamic Vinaigrette. We don't really mess with Bethany, you know, if you are a housewives lover like myself. We just like the dressing, all right? <laughs> take about, Maybe like that much, which is like a tablespoon and a half, maybe. This just gives you like a creaminess. But it also gives you the protein, right? Because my focus is protein. So, like for instance, Greek yogurt has 18 grams of protein for th three fourths of a cup. And I've been making the same thing every day because I already have this in my Lose It app, like, um, Measure, oop, measured out calorie wise. It's about 520 calories. So yeah, I've been eating it every day. It's like half of my caloric, you know, half of my calorie um, load. So, and that's why I keep making it because I already have it. And I don't mind eating the same thing every day if I enjoy it, if it's good. So next week, I'll probably do another salad for lunch or like a soup or something to kind of switch it up. But look at that. It looks, it's so good. Trust me. I know it looks kind of gross right now, but it tastes so good. It tastes so good. It tastes more than good. Okay. So the skinny girl vinaigrette is only five calories for two tablespoons. That's insane. And it's, low sugar too, so there's no sugar at all. Sugar free. So yeah, it's like perfect. And with the Greek yogurt, it just adds a little more um, protein, right? So, ooh, I should have took a picture of this before I added the dressing. Maybe I'll just dollop the dressing instead of like spreading it everywhere. That's what I'll do. So all of this, I don't get rid of it, you know? I use it all. I use the whole thing because it's already counted out in my calories. And I kind of went a little heavy on the Greek yogurt, but. So that's the final product. It's so good, guys. It's so freaking good. I will put the recipe for the pickled red onions in the description box, but I mean, you could do all this yourself and you can add whatever you want to your salads. I mean, salads are like fun, you know, you can add protein, you can make it a little bit more healthy or whatever your goals are. If you're like someone who isn't doing, if you're doing like low carb, you know, you can cancel out like the chickpeas, they're a little carby if you wanted to, but is such a good salad. All right, so I'm gonna eat this and I will check back in later. It looks so good. I don't even wanna mix it up because it looks so pretty. I'm gonna take a picture first. 
all gone? You ate all your food? See, this is what I'm talking about, man. As soon, I need to give him the food after I make mine because now he gonna wanna get out and I'm not even gonna be able to enjoy my food. Good riddance. <laughs> Good riddance. I'm trying to get all this dressing out of here. I need to edit some videos. I'm like so behind. That one video was stressing me out. Make sure y'all go watch it. The, the only 4K, 4K video y'all are gonna get. <laughs> I won't say ever, but I don't like waiting for things to, to load like that forever. I thought I was doing something wrong. Child. Mm -mm -mm. Challenge, I'm also, in that challenge, I'm doing intermittent fasting, so I eat from two to eight. It is now three o'clock, and this is my first meal. So that's why I'm okay with it being 500 calories, um, 547 calories to be exact, actually. And um, yeah, so today is day four. Technically, it should be day five, but I didn't work out yesterday, so if, it does, if I didn't work out, the day hasn't been counted in my opinion. Because my goal is to work out 75 days. Um, I'm also in another challenge with some other ladies, and the goal is to work out a minimum of 200 times in the year. So I'm on workout number nine of the year. <laughs> Um, so I'll be posting like my little workouts and how much calories I burned. And I also want to do the 75 soft and do jump rope every day because I want to see the results of jump rope because jump rope is such a great workout. It's a total body workout. You know, if you are doing it appropriately with your posture, your back, your shoulders, your muscles, like my body's sore and I've been at it for like five days straight now. How piece of chicken get all the way over here? All right guys, I'm about to eat this and relax. I'm doing laundry upstairs. I guess I'm not going anywhere, honestly. I lied to y'all, we, we ain't gonna make it to Home Goods. I cleaned up all my mess. Yeah, I'm about to go sit on the couch. Okay, update on the nursing. It's three o'clock. We have a nursing six thirty this morning. See, I still got my. Oh, I still got my sports bra on. Can't get to it. He be. <clears throat> We're done. We're done. Cut the show. Cut the show. We're done. Cause the way he been scratching and clawing at my face. Oh my God. Sorry y'all, I gotta eat. I'm sorry. Guys, when I tell y'all I am parented out, I am parented out. Like I am so worn out and tired. <laughs> I have not come to the, come back to this camera. I have not really done anything. <laughs> and I apologize. Um, I haven't done anything on my challenge, my 90 day challenge, nothing. It's been a crazy week and few days. I'm weaning the baby off of breast milk. And honestly, I it's made me sick. It's hard to explain. I've cried a lot. My boobs hurt so bad i smell like a pot of cabbage not in a good way because y'all make some good cabbage this smells like sauerkraut like i just reek and i'm constantly taking time to shower like this past weekend since my husband's been home i took like two showers yesterday just to relieve myself of the engorgement so I'm sorry guys, I have not really checked in. I've not really done anything. I haven't given you guys anything aesthetic because I cannot deliver anything half halfway. So we just got back from karate. I'm making dinner right now. And um, I'm probably gonna wash my hair. I wanna do a sacred hair 
um review i'm probably gonna do that tonight or tomorrow i don't know we'll see because i really don't feel good i'm like lightheaded i'm really just tired i think um it's stressful when you're trying to wean and i'm doing it cold turkey at that um we've been trying to wean slowly but i was just like i'm done i set the date on saturday and since saturday we have not nursed um it's currently monday so it's been like two full days um bedtime is probably the hardest because you know he would nurse to sleep so anyway it's been a really really stressful journey overall it's very taxing on the body and the mind and your emotions because it is still um you know hormonal so you do feel like hormonal shifts as you're as you're like weaning off my my boobs they're rock hard okay they're so hard they're a little less weighted today than yesterday and I, the cabbage leaves definitely helped but i'm about to change um into some just like comfortable gear to lounge around the house i'm just gonna put some sweatpants on and a t-shirt um but yeah it's been it's been crazy guys i'm it's just been wild and i'm just thankful that i'm, I'm glad that i did it uh, my hair is a mess i'm glad that i did it when my husband was at least going to be home at least two or three days out of the week because when i just can't take it i literally hand him off and like here babe you got to take him you got to hold him you got to do something because i can't i can't he like climbs on me he digs in my shirt like i really shouldn't even be wearing a shirt like this that he can access it to but yeah y'all but i just wanted to check in i wanted to say hi um i'm going to edit a video tonight um and post that for tomorrow because i want to stay consistent um i've been trying to watch like fashion and styling videos to get inspired but y'all i'll be honest i just haven't had the time to film edit or deliver any fashion content because i've just been so like overwhelmed with work and stuff but anyway i was just checking in to say hi i'm going to enjoy my dinner and have like three glasses of wine i don't even care about my fitness challenge either um i weighed in today and i am big okay <laughs> i'm big but we'll get it together all right bye guys Hey guys, I am doing my sacred hair care 
um, review and I'm also trying to do a vlog at the same time so make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss that or I'll probably link it because you'll probably see this after but I just wanted to check in because I haven't in a few days we have been we are almost completely weaned we have not nursed my baby in three days I just want to show you guys the battle wounds from going cold turkey I'm gonna do a full review on my process my boobs are still full of milk they hurt less than they did on day one um, which we had a time um, I'm about to like wash my hair and feel good about myself because it's been a rough three days it's been a very very tumultuous three days <laughs> but I think we're completely weaned um, and I think it really took a lot out of me and took me away from this and like filming and like editing and all of the things um, and I apologize for that but I am back I'm editing a video now I'm recording a video now I'm doing all the things today because you know I'm over the top and no challenge is a challenge for me I'm gonna do everything all at once because that's just my personality but anyway I'm just wanted to say hi I'm about to do a wash and go which I'll just insert little clips of it or the final part, but I'm trying my sacred hair care for the first time. I know I bought it like maybe three, four weeks ago and haven't had a chance to wash my hair because I, I bought it like three weeks ago, but I did a silk press. So this is the remnants of the silk press and me like working out and just not doing anything. I got an afro underneath here. So I'm about to wash my hair. I'm gonna do a wash and go. It's been a while since I've done a wash and go. And you know, guys, I cut my little curtain bangs. I have no idea what's gonna happen with this wash and go. Hopefully I have some cute bangs and it looks cute, but make sure you tune in and um, watch that with me. All right, I'll be back. The hydrating, I'm showing my phone first. The hydrating, the hydrating shampoo. I wanted to show you guys what it felt like and give you guys my first review of it. So let me just open it. I heard this is really hard to open. Does it have the, um... Oh, that looks so good. Ooh. Oh, it smells so good. I can detangle with it in. It's definitely a hydrating shampoo. Lotion has like a little opening here like this. Let's get it. Ooh. I'm just gonna use that lotion. And I'm not saying that it wouldn't work. It could work. It's pretty thick. It's pretty thick, but it looks nice on the ends, but I know my roots need something a little more thicker on the um, on the body. Like so, and I have my water bottle next to me. So let's do it. Hopefully, it comes out nice. I imagine it will. soaked so that's just with the cream so yeah you could I mean if you had a lighter curl than me you could just go ahead and but that don't work for me I need my hair mm -mm, no we need some gel to hold that down so I'm using our wet line extreme gel which is nice and thick that much to start just to see and always start at the ends and bring it up the line of stream gel is still my favorite I haven't done a wash and go in so long I'm excited to see like the results and how it turns out so my wash and go method is rake 
break, break like that, and then and then that's it. Next section. That's why I like watching goes. I'm gonna go a little bit more gel at the root because child. Not too much, but just a little bit more to give it a little more. Okay, and that's why you do small sections, so. Oops. Okay. This is the last bit. You don't have to do anything else. You don't have to do no takedowns. Just let it dry. I wasn't recording the tango properly. All right, I need to focus. Stop talking. And I do it again when I have this whole section done. Okay guys, so here is the final look with all the gel in. Obviously, I'm gonna let it air dry a little bit. Um, and then I'll stretch it later tonight is what I like to do. Um, I like to let it just dry and then stretch afterwards. But that's my preference, you can stretch now, but I just wanna see how these are gonna dry up a little bit. Um, I do like to clip it back out of my face, but I'm about to go carry on and do some other stuff and just let it air dry. Um, and then I'll probably go on with a diffuser later tonight. So I will show you guys what the finished product looks like probably tomorrow. Um, and then give you my like full details of how everything feels because that's really the kicker. When it dries, you can really feel your hair afterwards. So I know I look crazy. I got my scarf on. I have wash and go going and I'm not taking it down just to sit here okay I, I will take it down a little later and we'll hang out soon with that but i'm thinking of vlogging all week this week today's actually thursday um but i think i'm going to post um a vlog every day for the next seven days um i started a challenge um i'm on i'm i'm like doing so much at one time and I always do this to myself. Like, I always do this to myself. I bite off more than I can chew every single time. I think I'm this super person. Like, I know I am, but at the same time, I really think I am. <laughs> so I'm doing 75 soft challenge, if you've been watching my vlogs. 75 soft, soft challenge. I had to restart because I messed up on day six. So now I'm back on day one. Today's day two. <laughs> Um, and I feel like that's okay. I skipped like two days of working out and to me, the purpose for me is to work out for 75 days straight. So I said, you know what, I'm just gonna start over. Um, and that's just my personal, I'm doing 75 soft in comparison to 75 hard, where you have to work out twice a day. You have to, um, uh, you cut out, you know, you cut out bad food. You still, you drink a gallon of water a day. You're supposed to read for 20 minutes a day. Um, I think it's the, the hardest part for me was working out twice a day. So I don't have that in me right now. So for the 75 soft challenge, I did it upon myself to, um, you know, um, work out for a minimum of 30 minutes every day, even if it's just a walk outside. Um, to me, that's still important. It's still calories burned. It's still movement. So um, I'm still drinking a gallon of water a day, which I'm behind today. It's like 11 o'clock. It's 11 o'clock and I haven't drank anything. Um, and then I'm also meal prepping, which I showed you guys in my last vlog. Um, and that was this week this week i'm actually i'm actually still eating like some of the food from last week i'm still doing salads for lunch because that's what i like i think the next two days from now i'm gonna make like chopped turkey sandwiches with like multi-grain bread so i think i'm gonna buy that stuff today so that i can have that for um saturday sunday for lunch um but the 75 soft challenge for me is just a little bit easier with all my life things going on so 30 to 45 minutes minimum if I do anything more than that 
that's a great workout day. Um, my purpose um, is to fast, I'm also fasting each day. Um, I fast, um, I eat my first meal at two o'clock and I stop eating after eight. Last night, I was watching Love is Blind reunion and I had some candy and popcorn. So I was really mad at that, but it wasn't a lot. I mean, I had like two handfuls of popcorn. So like two cups, which was 220 calories. <laughs> And I had some candy. Candy is my weakness. If you're new to my channel, I love sour gummy candy. So I had a few um, sour belts and sour belts are my favorite. I had like five of them and I had popcorn and I really enjoyed it. And I just, um, I did a really hard workout um, yesterday morning and I didn't record it or anything, but I used to do this girl, this girl's workouts on YouTube called Carolyn Gervain. When I tell you she is a beast, she is phenomenal. I'm, it was a 30 minute workout and my entire body, it was a full body workout, no equipment. My entire body is sore. I mean, I can barely sit up in the bed because she did, I haven't done any ab work, core work. I haven't done core work in over two years, basically. So my core, I felt my pelvic floor rejuvenate from her video. I will link it. She's her channel. She has such great videos. If you're like, if you are looking, she's, she's pretty intense. I will say like she has different levels. She even has like different challenges that you go day over day. There's so many good like YouTubers that, um, fitness. I know Chloe Ting. I've done some of hers. Grow with Joe is another one. Um, and she used to be a big girl, not big, but she lost a lot of weight. And um, so I really like Grow With Joe. Um, yeah, so <laughs> I was on day six and I skipped one day of working out and I probably could have just said whatever, but I wanna be honest and continuous. Like I'm starting a series to chat about like what happened that week and um, what challenges I faced that week. So I'll be doing like a full series on that separate outside of it. So each week I'm going to give a, you know, update or rundown of what I'm doing and kind of like take pieces from what I've started and what I've been doing each week. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. But I'm thinking I'm also, and also started a challenge with, you know, shopping my closet for 90 days but I haven't been anywhere and I haven't got dressed in the last few days. I also stopped nursing. I weaned my child off of the breast. We have not nursed in over six days. Six days. I'm so proud of myself. But do you understand? I just did four different things. I just told y'all about four different things I challenged myself to, all in the span of the one week. That's why I haven't done anything or haven't turned this camera on because I've been doing way too much. And now I'm telling y'all that I want to vlog every day for a week. Why do I do it to myself? But I need to do this. I need to challenge myself um, and post every day for the next week. Even if it's just a 12 minute vlog. Um, yeah, I wanna do that for you guys. So anyway, today we're not doing much. I'm working, um, vlogging each day. I don't know what to call it. I don't know if I should call it March Madness and like vlog every day for the month of March, for the rest of the month of March. There's only two weeks left. So I still just should have started that a while ago. But <laughs> um, yeah, so I also did, I also did a wash and go, which I haven't done in a really long time. Um, and I finally used the Sacred Hair Care products, so look out for that review. That'll be soon. I'm probably gonna take my hair down and do like a little reveal today for day one wash go hair. Um, when I tell you, the products just smell so good and my hair just felt so moisturized. Um, I love it. I love, I want to try the protein treatment. Now, I just did a protein treatment maybe like six weeks ago in my hair so that's why i didn't buy the protein rice water treatment that she has um on the site but now i want to try it so i'll probably go buy that um soon but overall 
the hair care is really good i i do realize that it's not a one size fits all i'm sorry it is a one size fits all it's not geared to just natural hair but when she gave like a snippet or preview i did see like a comb like advertised like this white comb and like i'm assuming that she's probably gonna have like some other products launched like maybe a styling gel would be really good in that scent oh a styling gel or like a styling mousse or cream i imagine there's going to be more extension of the line but i would compare that line currently to like a way or olaplex type of line geared to like hair care right and not just styling um you know providing moisture providing pro protein providing treatments for your hair um as opposed to uh styling it just styling it um i didn't try the oil right because i have that almond allergy but yeah i really love it um i'm gonna do that reveal today i need to also put together like seven looks because i'm seven days behind on my challenge for the shop my closet so as a comp like a <laughs> con consolation for missing so many days i want to put together like a bunch of outfits and just like make a reel with like a bunch of outfits but i also want to create a link for people to go and shop like what's available or similar so like i can like add to it and also add it on my shop my style so i'm gonna do that today i'm gonna film that today i got new tripods so i'm like excited to use them also got a mic from the tiktok shop that i'm excited to use my son is so fussy he was up all night he's so fussy he just needs to go back to sleep child he was up from 1 30 to 4 30. he tore my face up like i don't have no makeup on or nothing y'all but you see these like cuts and he like tore my face, that's from the glasses, but he tore my face up trying to get to the boob. Like, when I tell you that was an emotional ride, um, that was an emotional ride. I don't remember what I did with Easton to wean him off, but I'm pretty sure I did the same thing. I went cold turkey. I was putting cabbage leaves in my bra, like child, that was stressful y'all that was stressful but i think we're done we're we're definitely over he tried to latch last night and i was like no 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 but yeah he was up from 1 30 to like 5 basically i was like holding him but he was talking the whole time and i was just like asleep basically so i didn't get up this morning to work out so I'm already behind so I have to work out tonight I think I'm just gonna work out tonight um and then shower and go to bed that's my plan because I have too much to do today um I'm actually about to join a meeting in a few minutes so I just wanted to turn the camera on say hi because I'm like going through and doing edits and like looking at um what I have and I'm like man I haven't talked to the camera in a while and I just want to you know get serious about this because i love i love the vlogs um i'm thinking of filming a sit down video too today so we're gonna do a lot today but we'll hang out later um i'll check back in after my call and we'll check be sure to subscribe if you haven't um i really have i really would like to get to my goal by the end of march it's March 14th. I would love to get to my goal of a thousand subscribers on Instagram. A thousand followers on Instagram. I would love to have a thousand followers actually on YouTube as well. So be sure to send this video, share this video, share my channel to any other moms or women you think would be interested in watching my content or content similar to this. Um, I look forward to um, building this tribe of, of individuals tribe of women tribe of men whoever wants to follow you know i imagine it's more women than any but um 
yeah so be sure to comment subscribe and also follow me on instagram and tiktok so we can chat a little more frequently i think it's p is it p that i'm filming why do i feel like you're not focusing I need to remember what mode I go in in the bathroom. I think this is it because I have this light here and I think that's what like makes it better. It's the light, honestly, if I'm being honest. So yeah, I think that's what does it. Anyway, so I'm about to do my takedown for my wash and go. Um, and I'm just gonna put on like some, um, I'm just gonna fill my eyebrows, honestly. Um, I don't feel like doing a full face, but I might do a little bit of my, say, lip. Yo, I love this. I wanted to film a favorites video, but I might have to save that for tomorrow. <laughs> I'm doing way too much at one time, as usual, as usual. Um, and I still haven't worked out today, so I'm gonna do that tonight at nine-ish, because I'm done eating at eight. So I wanna do it like right when I start getting a little hungry, which will be like nine, 10 o'clock. And that sounds about right. I love this stuff. I am obsessed with this. Oh, I was holding it upside down. I love it so much. So I'm just gonna go in with my Say slip tint and let the brow glue dry a little. My skin is so bad. If you saw, I did. I'm completely weaned, y'all though. Completely weaned. Tomorrow will be seven whole days, a whole week since I've nursed my baby and i'm so excited we went 17 months which was right on par with what i did with easton as well so it was perfect i mean honestly i couldn't ask for a better experience i mean i definitely recommend it to all moms it's so good for your baby. It's good for you. Um, it's just, you know, eventually you just get tired of it. I mean, it definitely helped, you know, with my healing and my uterus. Like, that's a known fact, but it's just such a good thing for you and the baby to do. Um, and then also, you... You know, it's really good for contracting your uterus back down to size. It also helps with uh, like losing a lot of that weight, you know, that <laughs> weight you gained. Um, now, I did lose about 20 pounds since having my baby, but he was probably nine of them. So really, I probably lost about, I lost about 30 pounds. When I weighed in, I think before I had him or at the hospital, I was like two, 70 maybe so if i'm being honest i don't care about numbers y'all y'all can't shame me oh no i used too much y'all can't shame me into um fathom like that is what it is all right i used way too much this i'm done i don't think i'm gonna even add anything else i'm not even gonna do like under eye or whatever i just want like my skin to look good oops i didn't go over my eyelids i'm gonna wipe that off because i don't like it on my eyelids have y'all been using my clean skin club link to get y'all uh 20 percent off for your uh towels have you have you if not the link's in the description box and my code is in the description box get y'all some 
get that 20% off. Use it, use it, use it. I love that. And I have been using their um, other products too that I talked about a while back, the pineapple um, vitamin C serum and the mist. I have been using it and I do love the way it feels. I usually use it at night, but I'm thinking of incorporating it in the day. I love things I can like just spray on. All right, y'all, I don't have much time. So I'll wash my hands, take it down and like feel attractive for a day, you know? And then I'm gonna put it right back like this before I go work out. But for now, we will put it down so we can show the video and do some other things. I would already did my skincare this morning, so that seems weird, but I still love this Say Slip Tint. If you're new to the channel, this is my favorite. Um, I'm trying to get better at linking everything, but it will be linked. All right, I'm going to kind of set this. I'm gonna use this to set today. Um, what else can I chat about? Yeah, so 75 soft. We're still going and we're still gonna go strong. Today, we start over because I wanna be honest with myself. I wanna do the full 75 days. No, um, no like mess ups, no, um, you know, no, no cheating the system like I want to do the full thing so today is day two even though I'd already got to like day five day six or whatever um like I said I'm going to be doing a full series and I'm going to talk about what my downfall was and it was trying to quit nursing at the same time doing too much always ends up with absolutely nothing so um, yeah, I'm going to do my jump rope tonight and hopefully that will be like enough to get me back into the grind of it. Um, doing it every day. Oh God, he really messed up my face y'all. So we're going to have to do some skincare tonight real proper like i might do a mask or something you guys can hang out with me we're gonna work out tonight for dinner i don't feel like cooking so we're probably gonna have leftovers um i'm probably just gonna eat my salmon honestly um uh, let's just go in with this this is my new favorite too i haven't used this in a long time so i'm back to my old faithful brow definer Okay, all right, and then I need to do the last portion of my review of my hair, which is gonna be in a separate video, but you guys will see it here, obviously, but I just wanna look, that looks good. See that there? Y'all know I'm good on my brows. Y'all know, y'all see them. I ain't faking the funk for y'all. I ain't got none. I wish I could get an eyebrow transplant, like, um. Making good. No shade, no tea. They look good. Look better than my alopecia eyebrow forehead. Anyway, we are going to go with that. Okay. I gotta try on five different looks in the next few minutes, so I'm not looking forward to that. But we're gonna do it because we need to, <laughs> honestly. All right, so my butter bronzer, which is my favorite, honestly. I probably could go with something a little darker, ow. But I like the coolness of this, I guess you would say. I don't like anything too dark unless I'm trying to do something dark so that's my like every day my favorite mascara better than sex I'm using this light because it looks really good and it makes my bathroom content look better than it did before I should get another one I lost my other one well it's in my car somewhere but
Y'all, I found some brow and lash serum in my drawer that I haven't used by Ordinary. I'm gonna use that tonight. I've never used it. I put it on my, um, I always test products because you guys know I have sensitive skin and I have allergies. So I always test my products on the innard of my wrist. So I tested that the other night and completely forgot to try it. So I'm gonna try it tonight after I wash my face. After I do my skincare, I'm gonna try it tonight. And yeah, I'm just looking for like a natural look. I'm not looking for a beat face, okay? Y'all should know this by now. Not a makeup channel. Okay. Now, I'm just gonna put on my Ethereum Cafe Collection lip balm. This is in the color, uh, this is in the color Latte, which is like a cute little pinky color. It's cute. I can't seem to locate my other ones. They're in my purses somewhere. But. All right, I'm gonna put some earrings on and then I'm gonna come back and do the reveal, but I'll put a snippet of it in here well, I'm gonna reveal for the sacred first and then we'll chat later. Okay, y'all, so I finished all the video. I need to do, I need to do a, um, I need to do a, I love this hair. Obviously, it gets better. Wash and goes just get better day after day, but I need to do a styling video, basically some reels. So I'm gonna put on a few outfits and if the reel makes it today or if the reel makes it tomorrow, it's fine. Either way, like, I'm not going to stress myself out. I'm trying to do too much at one time, but we're doing it, okay? So I'm going to try and do some styling, and I'll come check in with you guys later. Know that it's been a few days since I have posted a efforts to make up for my wrongdoings. I going to give y'all a bunch of outfits and be sure to follow and comment which one was your favorite. Alexa, Alexa, pause. Oh my face. Oh, hey guys. So, it's a little, we went for a walk. It's so beautiful out today. It's, it's like a high of like 73. And it's supposed to rain tomorrow. So, I've been getting out going for a walk. On these nice days, we just went for a walk with the boys. Just went for a walk with the boys. Um, and now I'm just about to make like a quick, quick swimming. 
Cause I've been cooking y'all. I made chicken and dumplings yesterday. Not yesterday, the day before. And then yesterday I made Mississippi pot roast. I did not vlog any of that and I wish I did. Um, because I really do enjoy cooking and I enjoy like, let me stand up straight. Like, so yeah, so I wish I, I wish I vlogged that because I made my own like dumplings and rolled out my own dough and dropped it in. I took a little snippet so I'll put it here. But my Mississippi pot roast I made yesterday and I just throw all of that in a crock pot. Not really nothing fancy. And I just did like mashed potatoes, but that was good. Um, tonight we're just having a very kid dinner. We're doing fish sticks and mac and cheese and I'm having my meal prep which is my salmon and string beans, which y'all would have saw last week. I packed a whole bunch of that in the freezer, in my deep freezer, so that I could like pull it out when I needed to. So I'm gonna have that, and hopefully that's enough. I don't think I got enough protein today, so after dinner I'm gonna make sure I drink my protein shake. I did have protein chips earlier, but I need real protein, so. I'll probably have like boiled eggs or something. But yeah. Mac and cheese for the kids. I have my meal prep, so. What are you doing? Nothing. What? I'm gonna go to Six Flags. Yeah, cool. Yeah. yeah. Why you got that because, face? Because I'm excited about to tell you because I got a Why can't I oh. not go with you? I got you? like the yearly pass thing. Why can't I not go with you? Because you don't like roller coasters. Yeah, I do. Not yet. I don't even think it's tall you're enough not yet. Even tall enough to ride them. When you can ride roller coasters, you'll be going with Jada for sure. Today? No, not today. You can't ride roller coasters yet. We'll go to Six Flags soon. But yeah, 